make it a team effort. As I said earlier, it's not a one person job. So partnering with local agencies, with the Army Corps of Engineers, partnering with different military sponsors, as well as working closely with the district ISSs in science and math, and even in reading and language arts and social studies, and making it a well-rounded experience. And tapping into the expertise of your teachers and your students and making sure that you're getting a lot of perspective for different ideas, but definitely making it a team effort. It is important for them to, one, build a partnership, establish and stay focused on the mission, and have a, what I call a tight, loose relationship. Tight enough to keep the mission in focus, but loose enough to empower your teachers and students. After all, the Earth Day theme this year was, it's our time to lead, as they were speaking to the children. So if that's the case, and we are passing on a planet to the next generation, it's our duty to make it a better place and to give them the stewardship to move forward in making it even better through their generation. The final results for we had uh, our performance measurements showed evidence that our kids increased in science and math. So our whole STEM initiative really paid off with the green ribbon. Um, it was a win-win-win with our community and our military partners. And so for any principal that's thinking about doing this, it is a win-win-win for everybody, for the community, the military community, the students, the teachers, and the administrators. It was a win for all of us but mainly our students.